everyone, today I will be showing you how to uninstall Internet Explorer from Windows 7. Let's face it, there are many different browsers out there, but Microsoft always seems to dump us with Internet Explorer. Well, not anymore. Here's how to get rid of it for good. Oh, and by the way, before you start this, make sure you have another browser installed. For example, Firefox, Opera, Chrome. And then there's, a list, there's a huge list. Right, so we go to Start. Control Panel. Programs. Turn Windows Features on or off. Their UAC uh, user account control window may pop up, and we wait for a few seconds for it to come up. Here it is. Now we uh, uncheck the box next to Internet Explorer 9 or 8, depending on whatever you've got installed, and this comes up. Turning off Internet Explorer 9 might affect other Windows features and programs installed on your computer, including default settings. Do you want to continue? Basically what it means is it will change the default program from Internet Explorer to whatever other uh, browser you've got installed. So you click Yes, and then OK. Then it will take a few minutes to change the settings. Nearly done now. While we're waiting, I will be making a lot more videos than this. Uh, my next video will be how to enable the administrator account, the true administrator account in Windows 7, like the one I'm using right now. I've also got a lot of other ideas for videos, but if you want... Oh, it's done. Okay, so it's gone now, so if we check in the uh, default programs... Give me a second. And we'll see in here that Internet Explorer is gone. So you should choose to uh, set a pro set your uh, chosen browser as a default, for in this case Firefox, and then you're done. Internet Explorer now is now completely gone from your system. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope you I hope that this helps you. Please watch out for my next videos. Comment, rate, and subscribe.